braces update. Are you ready? And I will have a senior graduating next year. I'm gonna hit shuffle and I'm gonna do my thing. And you're turning 40. Why did I crawl out of bed today? Good morning, friends. How are you? It is Tuesday morning. And I just dropped the kids off at school and it's nice and quiet. I can hear myself think. <laughs> um, I'm waiting for a text or phone call from my friend Tiffany who um, is moving and to know to go down to her new place to help her unpack. So just kind of waiting on that. And, and until I do, I'm just gonna keep cruising here. Braces update, are you ready? This is crazy right now. So I get my braces off. Are you ready? Write it down. Ready? Mark your calendars. On the 25th. What, what? Yes, the 25th. These come up. So for breakfast, I am having cottage cheese with grapefruit and blueberries. Okay, you guys, I just got dressed, put my apron on, I started folding clothes <clears throat> and picking up my bedroom from this morning, and I'm sitting here thinking, oh my gosh, today is my last day alone in the home this school year. Oh my gosh. The kids are done with school. Shaylee graduates from kindergarten tomorrow, and the kids get out this time next week. I'm like, oh. Today's the last day of me being alone in my home with the quiet. <laughs> it's been nice. It's, it's great when your kids get to the point where they're in school all day long just because you can get stuff done. Like, I am rushing. You guys, I don't just, <clears throat> when I'm home here as a stay-at-home mom, I don't just dilly-dally and just sit around. I'm constantly going, 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 going. Even when I don't need to leave the house, I'm working on something. And um, so I'm constantly busy. And it's nice trying to get all that I could get done before the kids get home. So it's crazy that this school year is over. It's done. It's gone. It's over. Holy crap balls. And my daughter, as of next week, will be a senior in high school. Going to college. She's taking college classes. She's already signed up. This is nuts. My baby has graduated kindergarten as of tomorrow, and I will have a senior graduating next year. This is crazy. This is blowing my mind. I remember I remember when we first started our family and everyone was like with Callie, oh, cherish these moments, they grow up so fast, it goes by so fast. And I was like, Yeah, yeah, you know, I'm sure it does. No, it does. Blink over your baby now graduating kindergarten. Your oldest is a senior in high school and will graduate. And you're turning 40 this year. It's depressing. It really is. Why did I crawl out of bed today? Oh well. Such is life, right? <laughs> okay, so I uh, got my apron on, dressed, has socks on my feet. My feet are freezing, you guys. I get so cold. I don't know what it is about me, but I get so cold. All right, time to keep plugging along. So you guys know that I love audiobooks when I'm busy working in my home. Love it. But I also love listening to music. And so on my Apple music thing on my phone, I don't know. Technology is 
seriously not my thing. I've downloaded like all my favorite songs so far that I'm liking right now and some oldies but goodies and so I'll put it on my library and I just hit shuffle and I just go about my day as well. Like I have stuff from Aerosmith. I love Aerosmith. A dream of mine, see them in concert. I have music from um, Phantom of the Opera. Um, oh my gosh, have you guys heard the song from a band called Disturbed? They're like a heavy metal, like heavy metal band. I don't know who they are, but they have this song right now called um, The Sound of Silence. It's the Simon and Garfunkel song, and it's just so good the way that they do it. I love his voice. It's like haunting and... I don't know, I love his voice. Oh, I love it! I don't know why, I just love it. Crazy, right? Derek introduced me to it, and the first time I heard it, it kind of like spooked me. I'm like, what is this? And then as I was listening, I'm like, I really like his voice. This is a cool song, how they did it. So. That is just one song that's on here, but I have Elvis. Of course I have my Elvis on here. If you guys are new, I am in love with Elvis. Have been since I was 11. Why? I do not know. I just do. I have Gwen Stefani's new album on here. I have songs from Les Mis, Old School Madonna. Who's That Girl? Do you guys remember that one? Who's That Girl? Who's That Girl? Love it! You're getting a little glimpse of me, I'm crazy. I have songs from My Best Friend's Wedding. That movie is Derek and I's movie, and we love the soundtrack. Moulin Rouge, um, Footloose, Dirty Dancing, um, songs from You Got Mail, I love that movie. I have Cheryl Crow on here. And then do you guys remember Martika? She's from the 80s. She was on the show Kids Incorporated. Um, her song Love Thy Will Be Done, um, she co-wrote it with Prince. It's so good. Oh, it's it's so gorgeous. I love her voice. Ugh. Anyway. Anyway, but there's Dirty Dancing, there's Rock, there's gospel there's like everything on this playlist and I just hit shuffle and just let it do its thing so that's what I'm gonna do right now I'm gonna hit shuffle and I'm gonna do my thing because it will make you want to clean. It's really weird. It is weird, but it's true. It's true. Ooh, that, looks, that looks so pretty with all the pillows. <laughs> Thanks. I got the text. I'm gonna go help my friend um, move in, but I wanted to share with you before I leave the slime. <laughs> Do you guys see the slime video from yesterday? If not, click below. But this is what it looks like. I covered it in this bowl, and this is what it looks like. This one is the one that I made. Callie's was just so thick that we ended up getting rid of it. But mine is like perfect today, you guys. It is so fun. 
It is so fun. Look at this. So Shaylee and Boston are gonna have fun playing with this after school. I'm gonna have to like break it in half and so they can play. But I have plenty of supplies to make more, but I'm not going to. Oh, so satisfying. Yeah, this is so fun. Oh my gosh, right? So fun. So easy. A little, I mean, it's just getting it to the consistency. But watch the video, it's so much fun. I love it, I love it. So yeah, I'll split that in half for Boston and Shaylee today so they can play. So I'm gonna keep this covered. I'm gonna wash my hands and um, I'm gonna head out now and go help my friend move into her new home. Look at her view. So pretty. Not too shabby. my garlic mincer no idea where it is when the kids clean the dishwasher and empty it out I can never find anything <laughs> all right so as you saw I'm getting dinner ready I have the sweet potatoes in the oven my dishwasher is so loud took my bands out of my mouth so I could talk to you I have nine days left with braces and I'm wearing those bands religiously okay um, so as you saw I am making dinner and sweet potatoes are in the oven. Okay, so what I am planning for dinner tonight is pork tenderloin. And um, and then I just get a text, I just got a text from Derek and he's working late. There's a major issue with one of their things at work and he might be home around nine. Oh my gosh, I feel so bad for him. He never has to work late and um, this, thing they're working on is having some issues so he's yeah I'm sure he's gonna grab food while he's at work but if he is hungry when he gets home there's gonna be a yummy meal for him and he can always take the leftovers to work tomorrow I have a, a video on this uh, I want to try a different recipe but I really want to see how my original recipe in the crock pot turns out in the instant pot so I have a recipe on this link is below it is so 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 good I found it on Pinterest love it um i don't use the red wine or is it white wine i think it costs red wine i use um chicken broth 
So I'm going to make the same recipe but in my Instapot and see how I like it and compare it. And then later on down the road I will try new recipes. Okay, so I am going to get this. This should probably take, from what I am reading online, the whole thing start to finish, probably about 40 minutes in my Instapot. It's all good. So I helped Tiffany unpack her beautiful kitchen. Her kitchen is awesome. I had so much fun putting her stuff away. I was like, where do you want this? She's like, I don't know. I'm like, if it was my kitchen, it was just so much fun. Like, I was just like, oh. she has all these cupboards and drawers. Oh, it was gorgeous. So... Uh, and then when I got home, I grabbed the kids, and then the bug guy came to spray our house. And now I'm working on dinner, and I am so tired. But I am excited to try this in the Instapot. So let's make this, get it in there, and have dinner. Okay, I have my um, pork tenderloin in the Instant Pot, and I'm going to pour my mixture down on it, which is a cup of water, three-fourths cup chicken broth, three tablespoons of soy sauce, and an onion soup packet. So I'm just going to get that down on it. Okay, uh, poured the mixture in and added all the garlic. This tastes so good, so I'm really excited for dinner. I'm excited to see how it turns out. Okay, I'm going to get my lid on and then set the settings. Okay, I'm going to do manual, high pressure for 30 minutes. Some recipes are 30, some are 35, so I'm going to start with 30. Okay, and then it will get to pressure and then start cooking. Here it is. I'm going to take it out and cut into it. See how it looks. It smells amazing. It is nummy. Mmm. It's really good. Mm -mm. I'm going to turn simmer on and create a gravy for it. Put some cornstarch and create a gravy. So what I did was I drained the um, the gravy and strained out a lot of the garlic and the onion. And then I put some cornstarch in and it's on saute and it's thickening up beautifully. And I just added some more of the garlic and onions that are in there in here. But I didn't want to have a ton. So it's thickening. It's beautiful. So I could put this right over the slices. I love the saute. Um, button. Oh my gosh, I'm learning, I'm learning, and it's so fun. Oh, this is nice and thick. I'm going to turn it off. All right, so that is done. It's going to simmer down and calm down. Um, so I'm going to slice up the tenderloin, and I have a salad ready and these sweet potatoes. So that is dinner. So I'm going to plate up. Ready for the next one? Well, I'm going to clean this mess up. The kids sure enjoyed dinner. Okay, so I'm going to clean up dinner and uh, edit this vlog. So that way when Derek gets home from work, I can be with him. And so, um, of course, I'm going to take you along as I clean. But I just wanted to say thank you for joining me today. I hope you're doing awesome. And we will see you soon. Bye.